Hi, John here. Today it's um, um, Thursday, the uh, 14th of uh, September 2017. I just want to ring uh, Andy. in the bush. <laughs> Behind Manahi, it's uh, John here. I'll be coming up on a monobus to um, Kawakawa uh, on the 20th to go to Porohos. They've got a hui on the 21st. That's a Wednesday. Oh, a Thursday, sorry. Uh, Thursday, 21st, yeah. 21st. So I'm coming up on the 20th, which is a Wednesday. Um, so I'll, I'll, I'll get a ride uh, if I don't get a ride from. Bruce's uh, Kotiro. Uh, I'll give her a ring um, because she'd more than likely be going to the Hui. Uh, otherwise, it's it's uh, it's my same old uh, walk on the road. But I won't be carrying a lot of things. So I'll just come with a uh, one bag um, on my back. <coughs> okay, um, just give me a call. Uh, I just want to make sure um, that um, our our things are, are, are separated from the uh, the Maori government. We've got our own dual government with the British and you especially with the uh, uh, Moriori. That's that's the top uppermost. Okay? All right. Bye. <coughs> so Bundy's phone is not working. Um, so the latest is I'm just putting out the notice, uh, a seven day notice from John Key today. Um, and that'll be um, on the 21st, 21st of um, uh, September, that's our, our, our meeting up in Hokianga at the Waitaha, Waitaha headquarters uh, at Te Porohau's place. Um, it's convenient to be a, a place to stay uh, and to focus on our job at hand with the Whakaminia and the uh, proclamations uh, of our title to this country and everything in it. So we're constructing this um, legally or le legality, legitimate title uh, with all the information I have here. Uh, we're filtering it through to the uh, hapu uh, to get their land back and their title back off the iwi. Um, that's the end of it, the iwi is corrupted and fraud. Um, <coughs> we're going to create that imbalance and make them accountable for all the missing uh, revenue that has gone to private investment interests, banking interests, instead of to the beneficiaries ourselves and our partners, the British and immigrants that have come from there to here. So um, we are steering this committee uh, with uh, the Whakaminia and Bundy, Waitai and uh, Heruini Karaka and Manahi uh, Parapara Mauhini as our legitim legitimate source of information and also our status as a state of sovereign authority 
and jurisdiction of Admiralty of King William IV and his flag, 1834, declaration of war flag for terrorists against threats of uh, outside interests uh, and their private corporations, crown corporations, businesses that have um, their own interests at heart and not ours, the beneficiaries and the commercial landowners of this country. Uh, it's for you to prove we are not the commercial landowners of this country. Uh, John Key and Bill English and all the politicians, you've got a trillion pounds on your head, bounty. As of the 6th of February 2017, a 21-gun salute to our documents to authenticate them. And then again, we had 21-gun salute on the 12th of September 2017. Uh, just prior, prior to that, the 11th of September 2017, uh, the 9-11 uh, coincides with that 11th September uh, date. And then the 21-gun salute in the morning from a musket uh, to mark that occasion at 5 o'clock in the morning. So I'm just trying to decipher the videos for that. Three videos um, um, uh, that uh, Tamihana took. And I took uh, the three muskets at 8 o'clock. He, he took the videos at 5 o'clock in the morning. And um, uh, so I've got them, but I've, I've taken them up the road to the experts to open them and to put them online as fact cited evidence of all our documents that are online, you can see them, the videos, you can see a lot of videos I put on just to mark the occasion and fix it in time as fact cited evidence that we had proclamations proclaimed the land belongs to the Hapu and the Whakameninga over the iwi of Titi Marae and Waitangi Marae. Uh, we put two, uh, uh, we put two those two marais with native, um, native grand jury trial magistrate courts straight to Edinburgh Magistrate Court in Scotland and Westminster Magistrate Court in Westminster City, Paddington County in England, Britain, UK. Our partners in the Magistrate Court, how they got here with Admiralty of King William King George IV, King George III, the father of King William IV, King George IV, and King Ernest Augustus I. Our reigning monarch, um, King of Britain, UK, Hanover, and now New Zealand and Pacific Islands, and the world, Commonwealth countries of the world, King Ernest Augustus V, and his son, Prince Regent Ernest Augustus. Uh, 33 years old and King Ernest Augustus 63 years old. We swear our oath of office to those two royal monarchs in Britain, UK, and we swear our oath of office to Paramount Chiefs Hongi Heka and Paramount Chiefs Tira Waikato Whare Here Here Manukau. And our descendants of those two. Chiefs, uh, Bundy Waitai for Hongi Hika, um, Cook Island, Tahitian, native, indigenous people, and also Manahi, Parapara Mohini, Mohini for Tira Waikato, Whare Here Here Manukau, the Moriori Paramount Chief of Reku Island Country, <coughs> Shadow Islands. That's his country, and that's those two chiefs living, and also Hirawini Kraka or Selwyn Clark, the um, hereditary paramount chief from Britain, UK, our partner, uh, Selwyn Clark uh, from Britain, uh, Britain, uh, England, UK. So those three are the commercial landowners of this country of New Zealand and Pacific Islands. For that matter, Crown Corporation Maui Crown. Fact cited evidence to <clears throat> the First Lord of, of the Sea, 
Sir Philip Jones, Royal British Navy, Britain, UK, our legal, legitimate, lawful, commercial trading bank, private contract, business, partner, ship of entity, court martial law, jurisdiction and authority from Britain to New Zealand and Pacific Islands. There. Okay, that's our connection with these three chiefs, paramount chiefs, <coughs> and myself, the surrogate king William the Fourth, the surrogate king George the Fourth, the surrogate king Ernest Augustus the First, the surrogate king George the Third, the father of those three kings, and Saint the surrogate Saint Patrick's from Belfast, Down Patrick County. My ancestors, the Rogans family, and Cosgroves come from there. And Jamie Patrick's Patrick family, eight point star citation and memorial where he's buried in Down Patrick, Belfast. Ulster to Ulster, North Island, New Zealand. Our connection to Ireland. <coughs> and <coughs> St. Mary's Church. Tiki Tiki in the registry of death, marriages, <coughs> and births. Um, in the Whakawhitira Native Magistrate Court, connected to the Aoro Native Magistrate Court Bank, and connected to Okiato Native Magistrate Court. Kororareka, Okiato, Russell, Bay of Islands. There, the three magistrate courts to Edinburgh Magistrate Court, land titles, Freemasons in Edinburgh, and also Westminster Magistrate Court in Westminster City, Paddington County, England, Britain, UK. So there is our legacy for you, John Key, Bill English, and all the politicians in New Zealand to refute a seven day video here, affidavit. I'm just saying this on this video, you're on notice. From today, goes on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, Google, that I'm giving you seven days notice from the 14th today at 7.30 a.m. or 9 a.m. this morning <coughs> to the 21st of September 2017, seven days when we are, our meeting is on at the uh, Hokianga at the Waitaha main headquarters, the Waitaha tribe, where I will bring this up there of this video. That I'm saying to you now, you're on notice <coughs> to refute everything I'm saying on this video about these three chiefs <coughs> partnership with Sir Philip Jones, First Lord of the Sea, the Royal British Navy, <coughs> Westminster <coughs> Magistrate Court in Westminster City. Not London, it's Westminster Buckingham Palace and Trafalgar Square, where Westminster Magistrate Court is an authority where you came from here legally or legitimately or illegally to New Zealand and settle your people. Selwyn Clark is the immigrant, immigrant that came from there to here and he is your partner to us the four Paramount Chiefs, myself, Bundy Waitai, Manahi, Parapara, Mohini, and Hiruini Karaka, or Selwyn Clark. Four Paramount Chiefs of status in a commercial private contract with Sir Philip Jones, First Lord of Sea, British Royal Navy, 
UK. Britain. So there is our partnership and the Westminster government <coughs> is the administrators of our business to recover all the debt owed as a trillion pound bounty on each of the named defendants in this court hearing. I'll be listing all those names today uh, as on notice. I will write them up, I'll read them out, I'll read the proclamations out to seize this country and the Pacific Islands back under the Maui Crown Memorial title and King William IV Memorial title, <coughs> King George IV Memorial title, King Ernest Augustus I Memorial title, St. Mary's Church Memorial title in the Holy Grail, Edinburgh, our title, and St. Patrick's Church Order in Downpatrick, Belfast, Memorial, our title, claim you must refer. The eight point star on our flag and on our badge and on our hat is our legal authority, commercial ownership to that brand name, St. Patrick. Through King William III, the creator of the Bank of England, the creator of the pound note sterling, and the creator of the municipality's eight point star. I'll find it to just show you what I mean. Point star. There, that John Key, you're liable, John Key. You're liable for all the debts in New Zealand. <clears throat> and you liable all the police, all the past Prime Ministers, Governor Generals, against this eight point star that you came here three weeks ago and put on your front as if you have ownership of this flag and our eight point star contract with King William III. Bloodlines. We have the bloodlines and you're following Queen's bloodlines. Queen Victoria and Queen Elizabeth's corrupted fraud bloodlines and Rothschilds. <coughs> and the church and state and <coughs> uh, Vatican City, private company, Church of England, private company, City of London, private company, Vatican City, private company, the United States of America, private company, US Federal State Government, private company, Washington DC, private company, Bank of England, private company, United Nations, private company, NATO, private company, IMF, private company, World Bank, private company, EU Parliament, private company, and the list goes on. You're liable against the municipalities for the British Navy, Royal British Navy and military to seize all the property off you of the Queen's Bench Court back into the King's Bench Court and our authority, Sheriff, Registrar of Birth, Deaths and Marriages, <coughs> to seize all the legal documents put together by the Freemasons, which I assume is on our side in Edinburgh, with the Edinburgh Magistrate Court contract between Paramount Chief Tira Waikato Fare Here Here Manakao and Lieutenant 
William Simons, 23rd Regiment, British Royal Navy, Magistrate, the man himself, Magistrate, Magistrate, authority to collect the King's Royal Revenue Price Possessions and Conquered Lands, leases that belong to the Crown, the Moai, King William IV, Crown, Corporations, Business, Partnership, Ship of Admiralty, Court Martial Law, that we exercise the right to seize all property with the pound note, the Moai pound note, as legal, legitimate instrument, Royal Crown instrument, Moai Crown instrument. We are the Crown, we are the municipalities to collect the rent off the leased lands and tax of all the leased land businesses, corporations, as levy debtor instruments, the pound note and gold currency, the gold in the Caribbean, 300 million metric tons of gold there, bars that are mixed into the dirt so you can't recognise it as bars, and 1.7 million metric tons of gold in the Philippines, and all the gold missing in the 9-11 New York building that went down, Twin Towers, all the fraud that the United States of America and the <coughs> US Federal State Government have terrorised the Americans and stole all their land and resources and created the heart machines and war to get the bill. The pound note bill and the water money currency under our own letters patent. Maui Crown King William IV Trust letters patent. Maui Crown King William III King George the Fourth, King William the Fourth, King Ernest Augustus the Fifth, reigning monarch, live. Man, our partner in the monarchy, Britain, UK, Hanover, New Zealand, Pacific Islands, and the Commonwealth countries of the world. The Maui Crown, British, dual. Government, Commonwealth, countries of the world. 250 countries in the world under this flag of authority. Now, Mr. John Key, you are to refute what I'm saying in seven days. We'll run that right up to the 28th of this month when we're having a court hearing against you as a bank fraudster. The court hearing is between 12 midday and 2 o'clock on Friday the 29th of September 2017 you must attend that hearing in the Auckland Native Grand Jury Trial Magistrate Court in front of these three Paramount Chiefs, myself, the Sheriff, Creditor, the Maui Powerhouse Bank Creditor with the pound note and a bill on your head. <clears throat> a billion trillion pound note, single note on your head for this country's land. That's just the land. That's not the individual. All individuals through the world have got a trillion pound on their head. All the corrupted Queen's agents of the, her crown and the church and state have got a trillion pound each on their head. 30% of the population of the world and 30% of each of 250 countries. A trillion pounds on your head. The 30% of those populations on this side, the Rothschilds and the Queen and Trump, in the United States of America, 
Thugs, Treacher State, Vatican, Pug, and all your commercial trading bank business under your Vice Admiral title against the Admiral title here of the 70% population of the world, creditor, and 70% of the population of New Zealand and singled out of 250 countries, a trillion pounds on your head debtors with the Maui Power Note. There. The Maui Power Note is written as a hundred as 970 million trillion trillion pound note to cover all that is at stake missing from our Queen Victoria Trust and also from the use of this Admiralty Court Martial Law flag that you've pirated and caused all the terrorism in the world. That's that figure wrapped up with the 300 million metric tons of gold in the Caribbean, Dutch. They are our partners, by the way. They are our partners. So we make a deal with them. But it's all the rest of the missing gold. That's our concern that we'll recover with our partners, legal partner, legitimate partner, lawful partner, Sir Philip Jones, First Lord of the Sea, British Royal Navy, England, Britain, UK. Okay, so there. That's the notice to you today. <coughs> Thursday, the 14th of September 2017. This is a citation, fact, evidence, affidavit on YouTube video to all who I accuse and I name, photograph, identify, expose publicly, internationally and nationally in New Zealand all the names that I say and write and list as debtors, fraud, accessories to Queen Elizabeth II's fraud as a treason, bitch, terrorist, and her counterparts, the Vatican City private concerns, private contracts with her. The two churches, the Catholic Church and the Church of England. Thuggery, piracy. <clears throat> business, racketeering, and using this flag, we're going to strip off you because we're the partners with this flag and those kings I just see. Not your king, not King George the first, the second, the fifth, the sixth. Not those, those are your bloodlines. They're not on the Dutch side. So there we are, that's the difference, the Dutch. You're on the German, French. We're on the German Dutch, and that's the wealth and inheritance down King Solomon's mines to William the Conqueror to King William the Third and King William the Fourth to Ernest Augustus, King Ernest Augustus the Fifth, and his son to abdicate from him, Prince Regent Ernest Augustus, 33 years old, as our King of Britain, UK, Hanover, and New Zealand, the Islands, and 250 countries under this flag. That's our oath of office to those royal monarchs and our own royal monarch, myself, and these paramount chiefs here, mine to my statue, East Island, and the statues that are standing in London, Brussels, <coughs> France, New Zealand, Dunedin, and Auckland, Chile, Washington DC, New York City, Singapore, and other countries where Maui stands. That's my Wānoa memorial title, monarch, crown title to this whole planet Earth in the four corners and four corners, eight point star on our flag and 
four corners, north, east, south, west, inside a circle, perfect. Title. Tipito East Cape, 6 a.m. Tipito Easter Island, 6 p.m. Oh, midday, up here. 6 a.m. Tipito East Cape, North Island, New Zealand, Alpha. 12 noon. Tipito Easter Island. 6 p.m. London, UK. Midnight. Tipito. I start. Perfect square. Three points of a triangle. Mirror image. Three points. Ra sun shines at the same time. The only three points on the earth. That's our title. And midnight down here. Perfect square. Inside a circle of light. The closest distance to the sun. And the first to see the sun in the world. On Tepito East Cape, 6 a.m. in the morning on my land blocks. The Mawai, Wahanoa land block. And the Rahui Mara, and the births, the deaths, the marriages, certificates, and Tiki Tiki, St. Mary's Church. Fixed in Whakafiti La Native Magistrate Bank Court. Tiki Tiki, Hiruharama. Mount Hikarangi, East Cape, North Island, Ulster, New Zealand. Straight to Ulster, Northern Ireland, Belfast, our partnership with this eight point star. This eight point star. Right there. Okay? Now, you have to refute or rebut or challenge those titles I've just seen on this video as cited evidence, fact. You have to refute. If you do not refute it or say anything about it or put a video, you must put a video with yourself in life, like myself, flesh and blood, lips moving, it's me, a real live person, not a dead person on your birth certificates which are touted to be worth 500 million. For us, it's more than that. Okay? It's more than that. I'll say that another day. But, of the value of all of that is inside the pound note. And the ANZ Bank here in Auckland, the ANZ Bank in London, will be passing that on the 29th of September 2017 in Te Unga Waka Marae. Native Grand Jury Trial Magistrate Court hearing against Stu John Key, banker, thug, pirate, and corrupted fraudster, bank fraudster to America and Britain. You are the mastermind behind that racketeering that I'm holding you to account with all those who are bankers, bank, banks connected to you are liable now, the whole lot of you, and you're liable, the whole of the police force here, the government, every single politician right back to the first time this flag landed here, and when they registered the first test of marriages on the stock market in 1831 in my Tiki Tiki St. Mary's Church and Whakawhitira Native Magistrate Court. That date and year is when this bill starts from and the flag in 1834 and the founding acknowledgement of King William IV of New Zealand being founded first by Cook, Captain James Cook in 1833 he acknowledged that and in 1834 the founding of New Zealand. Captain James Reddy Clinton and Whakawhitira, Native Grand Jury Court, or Native Magistrate Court. They uh, joined that to the Aorau Magistrate Court, Native Magistrate Court in Helensville, and joined that to Okiato Native Man Magistrate Court. He joined those three Magistrate Courts back to Westminster Magistrate Court, 
and Edinburgh Magistrate Court and St Mary's there, the church and the Holy Grail buried underneath it and all that wealth belongs to us, the partnership with the native blueprint right through the whole world from what I'm just saying on this video right now on the Thursday the 14th of September 2017 at exactly 7.52 a.m. You're on notice, John Key and Bill English, um, Patsy Reedy, uh, Governor General and Sean Elias, uh, Chief Justice of New Zealand, Supreme Court and your Lombard Finance scam, horse scam, you are I've had you on your, your own notice already and defaulted on a contract. You all defaulted on the contract with all those statements I made and your pictures on the wanted um, uh, wanted warrant on your head. A writ warrant, you're not immune from this flag and our ownership of this land. We are the commercial private contract land owners with the kings. The kings I name, the four kings and the four corners of the earth municipalities to collect the money and seize the land off you and seize all your property, your, all your investment, your banking, everything from you, strip you, bare dry, buy your ring, wedding ring, we'll seize that too. You can go in your underpants and onto Guatemala prison, Guantanamo Bay prison, all of you politicians. Are corrupted and you corrupted all the other countries in the world through the Rothschild banks and terrorizing the whole world to buy your pound note. We're going to strip your pound note with this pound note because you have no legitimacy to your title. We'll strip Israel of all the admiralty and bill them too. You're going to get the bill, Israel, the Vatican City. United States of America, all the countries that have used this flag and called everybody pirates. Now we're calling you the pirates and we'll use it on you the pirates because that's a pirate's flag. The 1834 Declaration of War flag sets a state of emergency over your countries and that's what I'm doing right now with these Paramount Chiefs and all the Paramount Chiefs in other native countries are doing the same with us. Okay, thank you very much. <clears throat> I'll list those names on another video shortly from our writ warrant of the <clears throat> control and possession writ warrant and property seizure writ warrants. I'll do that a little later and mark this day, seven days to the 21st of September. We're having a um, Pakaminia. Uh, government meeting in Hokianga. I'll make this notice clear today. Okay, the court hearing on the 29th of um, September is a Friday. Uh, it's open to the public, so you can come there. The um, court setting inside the Te Ungawaka Marae would hold about 100 people in the bottom, but we are uh, um, limiting the beds in the top to 30 for the old Komatua uh, and Kuya um, and you bring your own bedding to go and sleep in the bottom on the floor. So that's just to hear what we're saying all night after the hearing from 2 to, to from 12 to 2 p.m. Uh, we notify the police at the central police station to stand aside and also the Auckland District Court and Auckland High Court to stand aside the registry because we're running our registry and birth certificates and all that authority straight to Britain in the Westminster Magistrate Court and also the High Court of Admiralty and um, <coughs> Judiciary uh, in um, London, UK, Britain. Okay, so, so that's um, bring your food uh, and a donation, donation or koa to the hui and put it in the box in front on the table in front of me. I'll be running the hui and the court hearing myself with the three Paramount Chiefs sitting alongside me and others of uh, high ranking in the Whakamania and also in the Confederation of Chiefs and their 
corporate structures will be small business. Uh, people who are not familiar with this don't interfere or say anything because they'll be sent out of the hui or the hearing. We don't want anybody who doesn't know anything about how this banking operation scam works in the Queen's side of the ledger. Okay, thank you very much. Bye for now. See ya.